Hey. So I just wanted to quickly go over just a small thing here that and I uh, just wanted to know if anyone else had noticed. So on the top left there you can see the original rainbow flag, the symbol of the empire of the regime. And um, in the middle there you can see the updated version, which the difference is you can see the trans colors are coming in on the side there. Uh, there is also another updated version with a circle on it. I don't know if that's in use though. It looks even more ridiculous. And then the bottom right you can see the trans flag. It sort of looks like a licorice or something. Um, now, something you may have noticed and something I've noticed over the last few months is that you'll see the trans flag used far more in many situations than the LGBT flag, the rainbow flag. Um, in, in pride parades and things like that, you'll see that that is the symbol used more and more. Um, in the assault on Posey Parker, you'll see that it's essentially all, if not all, trans flags. I, I didn't see a single rainbow flag. I might have missed it, but... Um, now, this fits with what we've seen before. I mean, after all, 10 years ago, third wave feminism was very important to the regime. Um, they used it to help push a lot of policies, and now, today, feminism has been thrown into the bin. doesn't mean anything at all. Um, and the same thing is now happening to the rainbow group as a whole. Um, to you know, the gays, the lesbians, the buyers or whatnot, um, are now being thrown in the bin and because um, the, and they're now just fully utilizing the trans um, group. Um, and you'll see that as well on Twitter is that tr often training is LGB without the T. There's a lot of um, gays and things like that, that are annoyed. And so you can see how the regime will use a group for a while um, and utilize them to push policies and then their use will come to an end and they will throw them in the bin um, and so will it be that the rainbow flag is, is sort of phased out over time and, and the trans flag will remain as the only flag or will the rainbow flag keep being the, the, the symbol of the empire um, the other thing too is that you know, other groups like BLM and Antifa will they also be phased out at some point soon will the use become uh, will, they, will they, um, the use come to an end? I do think Antifa will, because police are able to do more and more um, what Antifa can do. Um, and BLM, I don't know, I guess we'll see. But trans, I don't think that will, because I can't sit on YouTube, but they are very useful to the regime for many reasons. Um, and one of them has to do with birth rates, lowering birth rates of certain groups. Also, trans people are now the second most protected group in the world. I can't tell you what the first is on YouTube here, but I'm sure you can guess. And so, yeah, I don't know. I just wanted to say, did you notice that? And I, I wish people would realize that when the regime hoists you up, that it's only going to be for a short time. You're, you're just there to provide a use to the regime and eventually we throw into the bin. Anyway, uh, yeah, this is a bit of a dangerous topic, so I better not say too much. Thank you for listening to you.